by the way, he has, and I don't think I've actually appreciated this in the past, he has one of the great power beards wow. of our time. Yeah. Please welcome Anthony Anderson. <laughs> Hi. I mean, Look I that, don't man. think, maybe it's because now I just am appreciating people so much more, just being able to see them. Like, we're all so isolated away from each other that I just right. have not appreciated your beard enough in person, so now I'm drinking it in virtually. Oh, well, well, well thank you, Kelly, but, but you're sitting next to a chiseled-faced man who I don't even recognize right now <laughs> because of his beard. Well, uh, well a little ask him the question. A little known secret, I've started to apply just for men color into my beard. I don't know if you've dabbled into any dyeing or coloring or mascara for yours, ah. but it seems ah. to be something more men are doing without talking about publicly. Oh, no, no, I, I, I talk about mine. I, I've, I've gone on uh, Instagram and Twitter and talked about it. I have a little uh, waterproof mascara in the corners <laughs> of my beard right now because that's where the gray comes in hard. I, every man needs a little cover-up and a little mascara in their toiletry okay. bag. It's okay. You know what? There's no shame in it, and I think it's you two should start a, a movement. We, we should actually we... talk about it. You know what I mean? So that more men yeah. don't live in the shadows yeah. of coloring their beard and yeah. shame. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Let's do it, Ryan. I'm down. Let's I've do it. Let, let's start a beard. <laughs> let's start a beard hair kit for men. I've been looking for a project with you, Anthony. Great idea. It's it's perfect. Yeah. So have you been, I mean, I see you've got a very trendy sweatshirt on. Have you been sort of relaxed in terms of the wardrobe at home? Any stretchy pants for you? Uh, no stretchy pants for me, uh, Ryan. Uh, and this is the reason. Back in January, um, I had gained a few LBs over the years. So back in January, I went vegan. And uh, up until maybe a month and a half ago, and I lost 35 pounds wow. uh, during uh, COVID. So I'm able to go into my closet now and pull out these sweaters that were so tight you could see my heartbeat and wear them <laughs> without being embarrassed in public. What, so, and now you eat a little bit of everything? So you are sort of convegan, conveniently vegan? Uh, yes, conveniently vegan. Like I'm uh, a convenient type two diabetic. I, I do things in moderation. <laughs>